We are under general quarters because a fighter patrol detected advanced ships from the Lucifer fleet approaching Vasuda Prime. Somehow the Shivan forces have circumvented our blockade at Antares and now control the Deneb system. We are en route to Deneb as we speak. ETA is 35 minutes. So when you leave here, report to your wing station for immediate mission briefings. Okay. The Lucifer itself is behind the Vanguard force, so we can expect it to make an appearance at any time. Oh, well, that's going to be a great idea, isn't it? Ooh. The Vasudan Terran Ulysses project has been completed, and the Galatea has received a complement of these fighters. It is the most maneuverable craft ever developed by the PVN or the GTA, and it should be extremely useful in this next series of sorties. It can also be equipped with the Prometheus Cannon, the most powerful cannon weapon we've ever developed. Use them both well. It is ugly as sin, I will say, but... I, no, I'll give it this. It has both the alien look and the Terran look. So interesting. Intelligence has concocted a daring plan to enable us to learn more oh, about the Shivans. No. We're going to attempt to capture a Shivan fighter. Suit up and report to your wing stations for briefings immediately. Oh, fuck. I hate this one. The Shivans have established quite a base of operations in the Deneb system. They have multiple supply depots scattered across the system, as well as several repair centers for their damaged fighters. Right. <sighs> Ten stages, okay. Each of the repair stations consists of a Kane-class cruiser and extra supplies. The Shakti is one such cruiser in the area. All fighters in the area around the Shakti are damaged and in need of repair. This makes them easy targets. One of our objectives in this mission is to put this repair station out of commission. This will greatly reduce Shivan capability in the Deneb system. Got it. One of the fighters being repaired by the Shakti is a Dragon-class fighter, designated Arjuna-1. The Dragon is the Shivan's most maneuverable craft and the most dangerous. So why are we going after this particular fighter? Intelligence has requested that we capture the dragon for research purposes. Capture the dragon. Since the Arjuna-1 dragon is very low on power, it is in a weakened state and is the best candidate for this operation. You must disable Arjuna-1 by destroying its engine subsystem. Easy enough. Once Arjuna-1 has been disabled, the Charon will dock with it and jump back to the Galatea. We must capture Arjuna-1. We cannot allow it to be destroyed. To this end, we've equipped your craft with an advanced disruptor cannon. Use it to take out its engines. Since this station is so poorly defended, we are sending only Alpha and Beta to attack. Alpha will cover Beta until the Shakti has been destroyed. Then Alpha will attempt to disable Arjuna-1. If Alpha fails to disable Arjuna-1, Delta Wing will be available. As Delta is currently guarding the Bastion, we will only send them in if it is imperative. However, we believe you can do it without their help. Sure. Because we are custom outfitting your ship, you will not be able to customize your loadout. Ugh. You have your orders. Dismissed. Well, I guess we commit then. Beta wing starting attack. Cover us, Alpha. No, I'm busy. Uh, the Shakti's easy. So my weapons don't have sounds. Interesting. Or oh, very little. Not nice at all. Dragon parts. I hate this next mission. This next mission is the worst. But it's also one of the more interesting missions. 
shield generators. We're destroying these? Alright. Arjuna 1 has been captured. Oh, hello. Attacking now, sir. All objectives accomplished. Return to base. Wow, <sighs> that was something you don't think I could really do without Beta disappearing like a bunch of shits. It's fine, honestly. Great work, Alpha One. We've destroyed a Shivan repair depot and managed to get a hold of an intact Shivan fighter. Our technicians are currently working on reverse engineering it. Good stuff, and don't even mention the freighter that I escaped. Yay. We'll see you next time. I, uh, I don't like the next one.